What is going on guys, WD here, and welcome back to the goalie career mode. I know it's been a while, but guys, I've been super busy. Please bear with me. I will try to get these episodes out much more often. Today, we're versing Montpellier, and you know the drill. We win this game, we stay at the top of the table. It's as simple as that. Right now, we only have Marseille to worry about. They're sitting in first place, but a win would put us one point ahead of them. However, it wasn't going to be that easy with a cross into the box and a header in the 33rd minute, but it goes over the bar. And we almost get a gift with Suzuko's shot getting blocked, and our attacker, his shot, takes a deflection but just misses the target there. 47th minute, I had to be on my toes, saving the first attempt, running back to my goal, and saving the second attempt as well. And off the corner kick, they got the ball once again with the header, passing it off to the player with the strike and I saved the attempt. At this point, we were just like, you know what, might as well just take some strikes with Mata just shooting way wide there. Don't know where that was going. 84th minute, Suzuko running down the wing, crossing it into the box. And Menez is there, passing it off to Verratti, but it gets blocked. No. With this game looking to be a draw, 88th minute, we were like, we're PSG, we are better than this, and Gamero puts it in the back of the net, in the last minute goal, last minute goal, and then a way out, long shot there, saved that attempt, and they put on the pressure in the 90th minute with the header, but it's put straight at me, I hold it, you know, just wasting the clock, and I have one of the biggest fails of the year, they get it right back, but they miss the target, we do end up taking this one to nothing. I almost lost two points there for my team. That would have been embarrassing, but you know, thank goodness the guy missed the target. Finally onto the second match against Saint Etienne. And after that, the scare, I was a little nervous going into this match, but you know, we're confident. We are sitting at the top of the table and all we have to do is win. That's the that is the goal of these matches just win every single match and we will get the league title comfortably however 13th minute they were persistent with the cross i saved the attempt 17th minute lavetsi getting his shot blocked and it goes out for a goal kick the same thing on our end with our defense just blocking those shots easy save for me off that block shot and in the 38th minute however shantom with the goal Beautiful layoff to him, and he puts it by the keeper. We're up one to nothing. But soon after, just before the half was ending, the first shot gets blocked, and the second shot. Uh, the attackers provided with an open net for the second shot, and he makes no mistake. All he had to do was just tap it, and it's tied one to one. And they didn't stop there. A nice strike there. I saved the attempt. 56th minute, crossing it into the box, however it's put straight at me, grab that easily, 84th minute, a through ball sends the attacker, but I run off my line, just sprint, and I'm just like, give me that, I grab the attempt, no shot is going by me, for sure, after that clumsy goal, and again, when this game looked to be a 1-1 score, Suzoko passing it off to Menez, to Lovetsi, in the 88th minute, what is with these late goals, man? I don't know what's happening with my team, but we do end up just winning it barely. And I end up with a match rating of 7.1. Now, some of you guys wanted to see my accomplishments, so I decided to put it up. And for overall goalkeeper progress, I'm at 33%. I have 86 diving, 73 handling, 83 kicking, 84 reflexes, and 81 positioning. And here is my career summary. I have won one league title, which is Barclays Premier League, two domestic cups. I've won 80 games, drew 37, lost 23, and I have had 77 clean sheets. More than half of my games played have been clean sheets. Thanks guys for watching. Until next time, see you later.